In the meantime, we want to head back out to National Landing for this week's On the Market segment. Good morning. Guys, hey, Wisdom, good to see you. Ursa, always good to see you as well. Listen, this is one of my favorite uh, times of the show because we get to talk about if you like a community, you see something you like on TV, you want to live here, we're going to give you the opportunity to do so. At least get an idea what the market is at this point. So joining us, as always, our friends from Lafayette Federal Credit Union. And, you know, we'll snag a local realtor or two, which in this case happens to be Carlos, who's joined us on many, many, many zip trips. Uh, Rick, good to see you this morning from Lafayette Federal mm -hmm. Credit Union. Uh, you said we actually had a little dip in interest rates, so we're we're hanging in there, even with all the the increases that we've seen lately. Definitely. So it, you know, it's not as bad as everybody thinks it's out there. Interest rates leveled off, even come down a little bit. So you know, it's still a great time to buy a house. Yeah. And what are you hearing from people, or what are you seeing from people right now when they're looking at that process? You know, with with everything that's been in the news lately about rate hikes going up, are people staying away? Are they afraid to? Are they looking at alternative means, maybe of financing? No, people are still buying houses. I mean, they're not refinancing as much as they were, but but the, the housing market's still going strong. People are buying houses as much as they ever were. Yeah, and this is one particular area where the market seems to be super strong, Carlos, and you yeah. know this area very well. Uh, and I'm not just talking about specifically a national landing, but Arlington in general. Um, what, what is the reason that you see that people want to live here? Absolutely, yeah. So national landing in this Arlington area is one of the hottest real estate markets. We have folks from all over the country and all over the world moving here for its dynamic workplace, a beautiful community, and it's really amazing to see it grow and flourish and be a great place to live for a long time. All right, so let's get into it. We've got three properties, as always, with three different price points, although, to be fair, in Arlington, you, you have two price points. You have, <laughs> a, you have affordable, and then you have everything else. Right. Let's start with the affordable. Absolutely. And, and what do we have here? Yep, yep. So for our first house, it's uh, 2465 Army Navy Drive, unit number 405. It's a two-bedroom, one full bath, corner unit condo. Perfect for first-time buyers. This is for four hundred thousand. Comes equipped with a nicely updated kitchen, included stainless steel appliances and breakfast bar, updated flooring, fresh paint and new lighting. Building includes great amenities like outdoor pool, fitness center, and movie theater, and includes a garage parking, which is a must for a lot of folks living close to downtown. So you got the amenities, which we were just talking about, very important to people who uh, live in this area. Arlington, to be fair, you've got a lot of apartments, you've got a lot of condos, you've got a lot of younger people. But there are people that say, you know what, when I have kids, I still want to be here, Absolutely. and I want to live here. So let's move on to something a little bit larger. Absolutely. Yeah, so for our second house, uh, it's at uh, 2013 Lynn Street, tucked away in a quiet street in Addison Heights neighborhood, listed for $1.4 million. It's a four bedroom, two and a half bath, just down the street from here near Pentagon Metro and Amazon headquarters. Uh, beautiful two story foyer, warm hardwood floors and spacious main level with palladium windows. Beautiful gourmet kitchen with chair molding, wood cabinetry, and Eden Bar Island with gas cooktop. All right, before we get to the showstopper here, um, you know, Rick, what, what are you seeing as far as, uh, uh, you know, if people change their strategy at all when it comes to uh, how much they think they can afford or what type of house they're looking for? I think they have to go through the process to get pre-approved to actually find out how much they can afford, That's and then they can right? they can go to Carlos and figure out can they afford that house or not. Yeah, and what do you? I mean, do people sometimes are they're intimidated by just the thought of that process. How do you ease their minds and say, look, this isn't uh, this is something that can be easily done in a short amount of time. We'll take care of this for you. You know, in this electronic world we live in, everybody puts in all their stuff online, you know, and I really got to emphasize, they got to get on the phone and talk to me so we can get on the same page as far as your goals and then find out if you really can afford that dream house. And then again, put them in, in touch with the realtor and, and, and find that house. Yeah, and that's very key. Be very open about what it is, your situation, what you're looking for, so you guys can work together as a partnership. And that counts for you as well. So let's dream a little bit. What's our dream house of the day? All right. Uh, so for our dream house of the day, it's 1126 17th Street. I love this house. It's a new custom built home with seven bedrooms, seven and a half baths, listed for 2.4 million. Of course, this is a dream house with all the features, contemporary style with elegant details throughout, beautiful gourmet kitchen with high-end appliances, including Sub-Zero fridge, Blue Star range, solid oak wood floors throughout, coppered ceilings in the living room with butler's pantry, a spacious master bedroom with marble ensuite bath, including double vanity, glass shower, deep freestanding tub, fully finished basement with recessed lighting. I mean, buyers absolutely love this. And 
It's still close to restaurants, entertainment, so it really has it all, and we can all dream, right? That is absolutely beautiful. Is there any chance, Carlos, any chance you can drop that last zero for me? <laughs> we can certainly try. Yeah, we, right? can, we can put in an offer at least, right? And have that refused as fast as you can ever imagine anything else. Absolutely. Uh, best way to get a hold of you if folks are interested in some financing and they want to check out more information? You can just go to lfcu.com, uh, click on one of the loan officers' websites, and, and then you can get all the information you need. All right. Well, Rick, I appreciate you being with us. Carlos has always shown off some of the great properties in the area, and there, yeah, I mean, we're literally running the range from 400000 to $2.4 million in those three properties, and you can find anything else in between. So thanks, guys. Beautiful always a pleasure. Uh, pleasure. Thanks for being with us. All right, Mr. Barnes.